So my friend Richard told me the other day that I don't cook. Not cook sometimes, not cook for special occasions, but that I don't cook. Like, ever. Never, never, never. Um, in a totally reasonable and measured response, I've done nothing but cook since he said that, unless I was away from home on, like, a given evening. Um, I also decided to buy a camera and make a cooking video as a big F you to Rich. F you, Rich! All right, so for this recipe, we are going to use some chicken, store-cut pineapple, because uh, I'm not so lazy that I want to use it from a can, but I am a little bit too lazy. I don't want to, like, cut up a whole pineapple by myself, because then it just makes a mess. Salt and pepper, thyme, an onion. Is it big? Is it small? I don't know. You tell me. Jalapeno and some scallion. All right, we're going to try to make our own teriyaki sauce. We're going to do that with some sesame seeds, some soy sauce, ginger, garlic, and my grocery store doesn't have mirin, but um, they do have white wine. In the event that this does not turn out well at all, um, I will just use some store-bought uh, teriyaki sauce instead, just in case. So we are just going to do a rough little chop of um, our ginger and garlic. For the ginger, make sure you take the skin off first. And right, now we're going to move over to my dirty stove. I probably should have cleaned this beforehand, but... Because it is not clean, that means I cook, Richard. We are now going to toast up some of our sesame seeds. I don't really have an exact amount, so say this many sesame seeds. Just as it starts to like smoke and toast or whatever, uh, you can pull them off the heat. So now we're going to add some sesame oil to the pan. Um, I forgot to list this in the ingredients. Oops. Throw the garlic and ginger in there. Uh, let it sizzle a little bit so the flavors can develop. All right, so we're gonna use some brown sugar. I forgot to mention that before. A quarter of a cup. Then we're gonna use half a cup of soy sauce, half a cup of white wine, which again is going to be our mirin substitute. Uh, make sure to drink some of it too because you like drinking. And then also add about a cup of water. Once you have a nice little simmer going on, add the sesame seeds back to the mixture and then kind of just stir and let it do its thing for a while. Take it off whenever you feel like it, whatever. I'm not gonna tell you what to do. Say, now. Now looks good. Whatever. Now. All right, time to give that a taste. Huh. Actually, tastes pretty good. All right, good job me. Okay, let's put the rest of this into a bottle. I'm noticing now that maybe I probably should have made more. Roll back the edges of a freezer bag, and then we're going to put the chicken breast in there. We are then going to use salt, pepper, thyme, and then we're going to pour in our sauce that we made. And then we're also going to chop up a scallion and throw that in there too. Uh, then what you're going to want to do is squeeze all the air out of the bag and then give the bag a bit of a tumble so you make sure that the whole piece of chicken gets coated. Now, um, nobody really just buys like one single chicken breast, so I got the Girls Gone Wild pack. And uh, we're going to make two more. Um... Two of them will go in the freezer, one of them we will use. Let the chicken marinate for at least a couple of hours, preferably you would let this sit overnight. All right, it's a couple of hours later now, it's darker, our oven is preheating to 450, and while that's happening, let's get the rest of our stuff ready. So we're going to chop up an onion, we're going to do this by chopping the onion in half. We're going to make some vertical cuts and then some horizontal cuts, and doing that will allow us to chop to get a bunch of little bits of onion. Uh, do it twice, and now you have double the onion. Now it's time to chop up our pineapple. Um, some of the pieces will have bits that were too close to the center, so they're going to be like really tough and hard. Uh, chop those off, throw them away. Uh, everything else, chop it into little bite-sized pieces. You don't want to make it so small that it's like pineapple mush, because you don't want pineapple mush. But don't make it so big that you just get one big mouthful of pineapple when you take a bite. So yeah, look at you. You chopped up a pineapple. Aren't you super? Five stars. Gold star. Amazing. Wonderful. Look at you go. Okay, we have, so, all right, we, we have pineapple now. Great, moving on. Peel and chop three cloves of garlic and then chop up your jalapeno. If you want it to be spicier, keep the seeds of the white stuff. Grab a baking tray, line it with aluminum foil, put on some non-stick spray, and put on your chicken. Drizzle the rest of the sauce from the bag and then put on a little more salt and pepper and it is ready to go. While the oven is finishing the last of the preheating, we are going to add some olive oil to a pan and then all of our onions first. Uh, we're going to let them brown up. 
Oven is now at 450 degrees. We're gonna pop the chicken in there for about a half an hour or until it registers 165 degrees internally. So we're gonna add our garlic, mix it up a little bit, add our pineapple, scrape up that brown stuff at the bottom. It tastes really good. Add our jalapeno and add our homemade teriyaki sauce. Stir it up a little bit and let it do its thing for a little while. Now I was a little bit low on the remaining homemade sauce, so I did add a bit of the store-bought as well. Keep it on low heat and uh, let it simmer while you stir. Yeah, that looks pretty good. All right, our chicken is out of the oven. How did we do? Nice. Time to cut that guy up and let's get a plate ready with some rice, a base layer of sauce, the chicken on top, and then some more of the sauce on top of that. Now, uh, this was really good. I enjoyed it a lot. So yeah, uh, take that wretched! Echo play purpose. Purpose Deluxe by Justin Bieber on Amazon Music. Echo play purpose from Avenue Q. Avenue Q, original Broadway cast recording by original Broadway cast of Avenue Q on Amazon Music. Echo play purpose from Avenue Q. Here are samples from Purpose Gives You Strength, motivational speech by Fearless Motivation on Amazon Music. <laughs> the original Broadway cast of Avenue Q. Damn it. On Amazon